Hey guys, this quick tip is all about handling multiple offers and specifically using a tool we call the sample multiple offer grid. Uh, this grid allows you to put all your multiple offers in one spot so you can compare them and even share them with your seller uh, so they can they can easily compare offers. So you can see in this grid, uh, by the way, I'll put the extension to it in the description, but it's under WRCOK office info forms. And you'll see the sample multiple offer grid. First thing you want to do is file and make a copy and move it into your file for the listing so that you have a copy of this if, forever, if at any time you need to refer back uh, to other offers or information about them. So basically here each column is just kind of a, a spot where you can put in the basic info about this. Um, so we can put in which offer number we're at, the last name of the buyer, um, doesn't matter. So you put in all the things, purchase price escalation if there is one, um, appraisal gap, earnest money, closing date, home warranty. So all of this is just different details about it. And if you had to, you can add different lines in here if there's some other things you want to add to compare or that the seller really cares about. I'm going to give you an example of this all filled out just so you guys can kind of see what it looks like. Um, so here's all of these. I usually put X's up here, and that means I got an actual copy of the offer versus just a verbal that I was putting in the info for. So here's all the info of 10 different offers that I've gotten. One cool thing about this is you can go to this compare on the next page and you can type in any two offers from your other page. Like if I want to compare offer three and seven, I can come in here and compare them side by side so I can see, uh, you know, one's got a higher purchase price, whatever, what the appraisal gap is and stuff like that. Um, so it's a pretty cool tool to use. Uh, if you want to share it with your clients, you can click this share button um, and send it to them so they can also see the info and refer back to it. When I'm done and we've you know picked an offer, say we pick offer five, I like to throw in a yellow background that tells me, hey, we selected this. And if I accept a backup, I'm gonna make it something like that so that I can always refer back to, oh, here was the main offer and here was the backup. Use this tool to help you compare, even if you only have two or three offers. Um, it's a really good option uh, in this market that we have. Hope this helps you guys when you're dealing with multiple offers.